fun and stunning. Just been surfing. I'm gonna expose myself for one second. It is Tuesday the 9th, I think it is. And it's meant to be really warm today. So that is really, really fun, and really exciting. Um, we, it's like 7.30 right now. We are gonna be going to Beverly Hills, do some browsing, do a little bit of shopping, taking in the atmosphere, the environment, and then at 2 p.m. I'm going surfing. So that has changed slightly. I was meant to go surfing in the morning, but now I'm doing it at two because of the weather. It's meant to be really windy because it's over windy because it's over in Malibu. So I'm just gonna make some breakfast. Give me a normal kettle, please. It's definitely warm today, I can feel that for sure. And it's only like 7.50 a.m. So it's definitely gonna be a warm day. So it's perfect for surfing actually, I feel. Um, oh, it's out of focus. Anyway, I'm just eating my toast on these beautiful palm trees. And then I'm gonna get ready, I'm gonna head to Beverly. Okay, so I didn't actually vlog much of my trip to Beverly Hills. It was really fun being in the moment and that was my goal of the holiday. Um, but I went to Beverly Hills and we got the roof off the car, but I tell you something, I am still embarrassed from how we got it off. It was so embarrassing, we struggled so bad and getting it on was even worse. Um, but it's actually really easy, it's like a jigsaw if you actually know what you're doing. But it's such a gorgeous day. So I was driving down Rodeo Drive and it was just so much fun. Like, I... I had such a good time and then we yeah we we drove around took some cute pictures some really bad pictures um, like this is a terrible picture slanted I don't know what was happening but then we went and had sort of like lunch breakfast sorry at Beverly Wiltshire Hotel a big fancy one okay, so we've just came to Beverly Wilt Girl, you made it up. I believed you. <laughs> um, we're at this hotel in Beverly Hills in the little cafe bit, and we're sat outside. I've got an almond croissant because it's really expensive. Um, but this is the view. We've got like a little heater because it's clearly not hot enough. Um, and then we're gonna like have a look in the shop and whatnot. This is the the hotel. Like it's so fancy. Our day will drive. What did you get, Sophie? Just a little item or two in Saint Laurent. <laughs> Sorry, that was really. It is so warm, by the way. The sun is stunning, and I did a fun purchase. It's not a really expensive purchase, but it was fun. First try, Haley Bieber City. Ignore my scary look. I've just been surfing. And I had the best time of my life, but my hair is utterly ruined right now. Um, I had so much fun, but then I did realize I also forgot a towel, so I had to like dry myself in my shirt dress that I had on and then put this one over so I didn't feel as wet. But I'm so tired now, but I had so much fun and I seen a seal. I seen a seal, it was like coming up to us watching us, it was really fun. But I had a blast and um, it was just so much fun and I'll insert all of like the pictures and stuff and it's just like surfing in Malibu is just amazing and I stood up on the board and I sat on the board and I fell off the board I went under the waves I thought I was gonna die no I was actually kind of fun I didn't think I was gonna die but no it's a hard work but genuinely so happy I did that so now it's like what is time 3 50 we need to find a place for fuel can you help put fuel in because my outfit. Fuck. Okay, we're gonna go do that and then we're gonna go back home and I'm gonna show you some of my purchases. <laughs> Parked up for surfing. It's a really cute little street and we got the main road up there, but this is so nice and genuinely the best waters I've ever been to. It was so beautiful. Um, it was just so much fun. I would do it again. I would stay there all day. No wonder people love the sea. Okay, so I inserted some clips of me surfing and I tell you something, I genuinely have not loved being in the sea more than I did at this very moment in time. And I 
I'm actually looking at surf lessons in Scotland. It's crazy because it's cold here, but I genuinely loved it so much. And the instructor that I had, Demetrius, was the best instructor I ever had. So he teaches at Malibu Surf Club, um, surfing school. Sorry, I'll put all the details in the, uh, the description, but he's like an Olympian surfer. He's incredible. So I was so lucky to be coached by him and by the way I'm standing up on my first ever lesson of course I fell probably a lot more times than I did stand up but I actually stood up and I actually served it's incredible what a high by the way and it is utterly exhausting but genuinely like the best and he like adapted my approach to sort of getting on the board and standing up to suit my suit me and like how I would do it like my own body so it was really really great and it makes me want to be back there like right now because I will literally like fly out there just to do some lessons of him. I mean I wouldn't because that's crazy but it's it just shows you how good they are and price wise I think 100% like worth it. So it was like $120 excluding tax I think for an hour and a half but bear in mind it's one on one they provide everything and the coach is incredible like he had me standing up on the board. I've not even been paddle boarding. I barely go in the sea, I barely swim. So look at that, I served all the way to the beach, which is ha exactly what the goal of this lesson was. I love it. Okay, so we are on our way back from Malibu um, and we've had so much traffic. Have a look at this. That was 35. I can't remember what it said at the start. Was it like 40 something? Like it was like 40 minutes worth of traffic and it's so annoying. I'm only needing to go 16 miles, this is not okay i'm like it probably could be quicker if i moved over to one of the fast lanes but i'm uh, shy <laughs> but it's insane um but i mean it's nice scenery but 42 minutes to go 16 miles what Okay, I know there's a lot of voiceovers because I'm not really good at vlogging, but then we went to Catch LA, which is me and my sister's favorite restaurant. So of course we had to try and fit it in and it was incredible. We had so much food. I mean, not a lot of food, but we had like, it was a lot for us. And this was my outfit, one of my favorite ones I just created in the moment and I loved it. And it was just so fun just being there with my sister. Um, I loved every minute of it, it was amazing. Quite late, so I'm trying to be quiet. I've done a lot of purchasing. This is my favourite one. Also, I did some shopping for the Sephora. What do you this leave this one for last? Look at this wonderful. Let's do Sephora. I do have one more thing, but it's a bit bad because I was using it. Um but I got this SOS Tower 28 SOS. <laughs> daily rescue facial spray um because it's meant to help with to purify and renew a happy solution for angry skin so it looks like that um so i'm really excited we just got a mini one because i was scared it might react with my skin so i thought if i get a mini one then it feels a bit nicer and then i also got a really nice body scrub but i'm using it so it's in the bathroom and then, because I was with Sephora, you get um, like a happy birthday treat. So I got to choose Youth to the People, which is just a bunch of like cleansers, um, which is just a bunch of like cleansers, masks, and a moisturizer. It looks like that. So that is exciting. And then in the bigger box. opened these but I love these kits that you get from Sephora they're one of my favorite things because one they're a decent price and two you get um I'm really tired by the way long day um you get to try out a bunch of new products so I got this it was $52 excluding tax and you get one two three four full size kits and a lip oil a beauty blender a K18 hair oil perfect uh, super glue, glow sun cream which is tinted I do love this stuff I've got the regular one at home so it's fun to try the tinted one 
Isles of Paradise facial tint, which is like for fake tan, perfect. I have a also got like a little, I think it's a primer from, I think it's Glow Recipe Primer. It's really cute, it's pink. And then I've got milk and I was actually looking at their makeup, so it's quite fun that I get to try out their blush. So that's all the items. And then I've somehow misplaced, um, I will find it, but I've just currently misplaced um, my hyaluronic acid. So I went and got another one because I know it was nearly out um, and I love it. And then alongside that, I got, alongside that, I got the, an eye cream, which is from Incubus Caffeine Eye Cream. So that's fun. And then I got this really cute chrome legs multi-chrome gel for face and eyes from Denisa Myrick's Beauty. We swatched it with colours look insane. Um, I'm going to try it out with Coachella. And then going on to the most important purchase. This is from What Goes Around Comes Around, a vintage designer shop in Beverly Hills. Um, it's a bit of an accident that we walked in there, but I came out with something very, very fun. And usually I'm not a fan of designer clothing because I think you can get a better quality and more for your money from a different brand, from a cheaper brand, non-designer. But then I've seen this and I know the rule of vintage is like you always regret it if you don't get it. It's a bad rule, I know. So, what I got... Okay. It's in this really cute... Wrap. Let me hold you up better. Okay. So it looks like this. I got this really cute Versace crop top. I'm in love. It is beautiful. Um, it's got a cute zip. It's insane quality, by the way. Um, I put it on and it's like this needs to come home with me. Like it just looked perfect on me. Um, but I want to keep it wrapped up for as long as possible <laughs> so I don't feel so bad for using it. Um, but that's my little haul. I probably will not buy anything else because this took a lot of my money. I want to I wanna expose myself for one second and then pretend I was never did this. I never did this. Okay, I'm doing it. Okay, also you need to add on tax but then also put it into pounds and it's a little bit better um but it's really cute and it's just perfect you could dress up and make it casual as well i love it i fell in love a second i put it on 